I'm going to give you one more chance to make up for this empty. Well, Chris, I'm really sorry. But today has probably been one of the worst days of my entire life. Why don't you tell me all the gory details over dinner? Thanks, but I'm not feeling very well. What's the matter, General? Did you lose the war? Just the first battle. I'll win the next one for sure. Bobby, why don't you do something for yourself? Learn what good generals learn. Next time, plan your strategy before you go to the front. I'll see you around. Hi, uh, Luke Spencer, please. Luke! Hi, Bobby! <laughs> Bobby, who, your sister? Hey, look, the phone works both ways, you know. I haven't heard from you in a long time either. Oh, nothing. Just working real hard trying to earn a living. Listen, Luke. Um, I know that we haven't talked for a long time, but um, if there's one thing about us Spencers, it's that we always did stick together in times of trouble, right? Uh, well, yes, there is one little favor that I would like you to do for me. I had to guess. Uh, listen, Luke, um, I'm at work right now, so I can't talk too much, but there's some girl I know who's really done me dirt. And if anybody can help me even the score, it's you. So what do you say? Will you help me make her sorry she ever crossed a Spencer? Sorry to cut out on you like that, sis, right after you got here, but, uh... Business before pleasure, you know what I mean? It's a pretty strange place to do business, isn't it, Luke? Look, I don't tell you how to run your life, so don't tell me how to run mine, okay? I wasn't. I just... Enough entered... small talk. Why'd you call me? Luke, you're my brother. I had a problem between now and... Oh, Bobby, problem. come on. This is Luke you're talking to. You've been back in Fort Charles for over a year now. This is the first word I've heard from you in all that time. How'd you know I was back? Yeah, I know everything. Guido Monero told me. That creep. You still hang out. Watch out. your mouth when you talk about my friends, okay? So, you gonna be a real trained nurse? You living in a posh apartment with some older nurse? That's quite a change in lifestyle. All right. Sure. Except now you need a favor from your big brother. I guess I shouldn't be surprised at that. Why else would you call me? Oh, Luke, I'm sorry. I would have... Well, save it, Bobby. You've always been ashamed of your family, so none of us dropped dead from shock when you cut us off. But like we said on the phone, when the heat is on, the Spencer's stick together. So, go on. Tell me what's with this high school kid who's on parole or something that you want to even the score with. myself when it first broke. Laura Weber. Tell me, how come you were all in a sweat over some high school kid that knocked off her lover? Listen, Luke, I don't want to go into all the grisly details. This chick has been trouble for me for a long time. You never had any trouble before getting rid of people who got in your way? What's the matter, baby? You losing your touch? I try to handle it myself today. Too many people at that hospital know how I feel about her. They're gonna be watching every move I make. So from now on, I can't have anything to do with her personally. I could ruin everything I've been so hard for. Oh, I know that look, Bobby. I'd hate to be on the receiving end. Okay. What do you want me to do about her? I want her sent off to reform school. That's where she belongs, and that's where she'd be if her parents weren't famous doctors with big, expensive lawyers to pull strings and get her off. <laughs> what? What's so funny? Oh, 
baby. You got the wrong number. Oh, look, I got I got no pull with the juvenile court. Oh, look, if you want to rough up a little bit, I'll talk to a couple of the boys here about that. No. <laughs> Will you listen? I got a plan. I, mean, I can't handle it myself. I need someone to pull it off for me. So listen. And listen very carefully. Okay, okay, sis. Got it. I know it's set up when I hear one. What do you think? I'm impressed. Will you do it? Well, I can't guarantee it'll work. But I'll go along with it. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Hey, hey, come on. Don't get carried away. Hey, come on. Tell me something. What's in this for you? I mean, I mean, besides even in the score with this Weber chick. Maybe the guy will give me the life I've always wanted. Oh, sure. I should have guessed that. There had to be some guy in this somewhere. Look, just don't do anything until I tell you to, okay? Sure. I won't call this uh, Higgins until you tell me to. All right, but keep the number handy because it's going to happen fast. Okay. Where are you going? Home. I gotta think this through very carefully. Look, it sounds to me like you already did. Hey, come on, stick around. Let me buy you another drink. Let's come over here to, to the booth over there. Meet a couple of my friends, huh? Not tonight, look. Right. Still ashamed of everybody, aren't you? And their friends. You hear from Cousin Lorraine lately? No. And I don't expect to. Listen, look, I gotta get going. Thanks again for coming to my rescue. What's family for? Right? <laughs> 